Astrox here. Welcome back to Five Nights at Freddy's Killer in Purple Remastered. Now, guys, this is the last and final version of the game before it is released to the public. Golden Freddy Cinemas was kind enough to send us the updated version, and let me tell you, there is a lot of stuff that we have to go over in today's video. Now, that includes a whole bunch of new animatronics, some suits, and more. But before we even get into that, I will tell you the objective of today's video is to try different animatronics and see which one has the most lure for the kids. So go ahead, do me a big favor. If you have an idea of which animatronic you think is gonna be the best for capturing children, go ahead and comment it down below and let's go ahead and jump in. So which animatronic should we start off with? There's some OOP ones. Oh my God, look guys, I'm on the, uh, a different version of the game where we don't have Halloween unlocked now and we don't have Christmas either, but that's fine because we're not even gonna play with them. Obviously the last time we played as Dreadbear, all the kids freaked out and we couldn't capture anybody. We just got arrested by the police. So let's see. I think Pit Bonnie would be a good one to start off with. And as Burn Trap as well. Not to mention, ooh, MXES and Eleanor, which we haven't played as Eleanor just yet. But let's go ahead and start off as Burn Trap. And we're going to start off at Freddy Fazbear's... Uh, wait, no, actually... No, this is Fred Bear and Friends. Yeah, this is Fred Bear and Friends. Okay, that's where we're going to start off. Cool, cool, cool. Yep, there it is. Fred Bear's Family Diner. All right, so Burn Trap's ability is to hack parents and make the parents kill their own kids for 10 seconds which is absolutely insane. By the way, I love the way that GFC made it more of an interactive third person. You can literally look all the way around now, but there's one thing that I'm missing in here that I saw in my brother's video. He was able to unlock animatronic suits inside of Fredbear's, which we don't have just yet. Uh, so I guess we should try and earn some more money to make that happen. Um, let's actually save ourselves the time and see if we can activate Burn Trap's ability and see what the parents are going to do to their own children. Oh my god, they're chasing them down! They're chasing them down like Cyborg AI! Look at the points at the top! We're collecting so many! 1382, alright. And to make things even better, I'm pretty sure all of the kids want to follow Burn Trap, which is so bizarre. Look at him! Look at this guy! Would you follow this thing around? He looks like scrap metal. He looks pure evil. You can see the brain coming through his skull. Why would any kid want to follow it? Well, then again, these are ghost kids. Am I right? Now let's go ahead and get all these children to follow us. Bring us back, bring them back into this little room over here. And then we'll head over to the next stage. All right, guys. So now we are over in the sister location. And I will say, man, I wish I could take these posters off. Mainly because of this guy right here. Let me tell you, this T. Jolfar guy, he steals thumbnails from my brother and myself all the time. Gives absolutely no credit. And hopefully if you click this picture, it makes a little squeak squeak noise because he is an absolute rat on YouTube. He doesn't do any of his own content. He literally copies everybody. But one big update here is I don't remember Ballora actually being in here. And there's a couple new suits, like I was saying, that we still need to unlock. So let's try and get some of these kids to follow us. And one more thing. Oh, man, I totally forgot. We need to try and get as many kids to follow us. But the ones that don't, maybe we can get their parents to, you know, take care of business for us. All right. So let's go ahead and grab as many as we can. Okay, some of them are, are a little smarter than I thought. They don't trust Burn Trap, which, you know, to be honest, that's probably the right way to go about this. And also, when the kids are getting killed by their parents, why on earth don't the police arrest the parents? Just realize that. All right, so here we go. These are the kids that will follow us, and they are eager to follow. Look, at they're literally running to us like we're One Direction or something on tour. All right, so we got everybody to follow us. Let's go ahead and activate our ability and see if they... Finish off the kids. Yeah. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. These are mine. These are mine. Come in quick, kids. I need to scoop you. I get way more points for that. All right. Let's go ahead and close them out. Oh, oh okay. Wait. I can't. Wait. Wait. I can't kill children with you in here. You need to go, lady. Oh, boy. Okay. Well, I mean, can I? Can I just, can I just do what I got to do without her telling no, she's going to snitch on us for sure. All right, we're going upstairs. Forget it. We're taking the children. We're going upstairs. There's no way I'm staying down here with these ladies because they're definitely going to snitch on us. Come on, guys. Let's go. Up, 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 up. Everybody in the elevator. Come on. Not what? Get out of the elevator, lady. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Come on. Where's the, where are the rest of them? Guys, what are you girls doing? You're all stuck in the chairs. Oh, my gosh. This is like, it's like herding sheep. It's literally like herding sheep. There we go. Here we go. Sheep to the slaughter, baby. Come on in. Come on into the elevator, ladies. Is that everybody? If it's not, we're leaving the rest behind. 
All right, get it back. Get back in. Get back in. Get back in. Okay, okay, here we go. See you later. It's so dreary. I don't like this. I don't like being in sister location. There's no music. You're just sitting there in complete silence. Yeah, all you can hear is footsteps. It sounds like I'm wearing high heels. And that. <laughs> I mean, I don't think Burn Trap is wearing high heels. All right, here we go. Back to the music. Now we're talking. Wait, no, no, nobody outside. Nobody go outside. Uh-huh. And we got the camera on us. Also, if you hit R, by the way, you can see what exactly is looking at you. So, like, right now, I'm, at, I'm in a blind spot. I could kill these kids and get away with it. Anyways, moving on. Let's go ahead and continue to collect our kids. Bro, these got they have to be some type of cyborg AI, right? Am I wrong about this? They all dress the same. They all look the same. They slowly turn their heads. This is some iRobot style children. If I've ever seen some iRobot style children, it is these kids. All right, perfect. I think we've got a whole bunch. Yeah, come on, kids. Let's go. We need to follow one more group here. Everybody follow me into the final stage. So, I mean, so far, Burn Trap has pretty much gotten every kid. I say he's at about a 90% chance of getting kids to follow him, which is pretty good. I'm not going to lie to you. 90% chance is solid, but I still think, I still think uh, maybe Spring Trap might be better. Not Spring Trap. I'm sorry. Maybe Pit Spring Bonnie might be better. All right, here we go. That's a lot of kiddos. Technically, if I wanted to get more points, we would take them to a better suit, but this will do. Come on, everybody in. Come on in. Come on in. All right. Okay. All right. Hopefully, no parents decide to follow this time. Everybody in. Like, find a way in, bros. This is the biggest room we got. Okay. Oh, oh, oh my God. Okay. Yep, 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 yep. There's a lot of kids, dude. This is a lot. How many kids do you think are here? Like 50? I'd say probably like 50 something. Okay. Now for the grand surprise. My knife. Ah! <laughs> I'm just mowing them down. No, no, don't accidentally open the door. Don't accidentally open the door. Oh! Oh, the door! No one! Oh, my God! No, no, no! That's it. That's it. Everybody in. Everybody in the suit. You'll never stop me, coppers. You'll never stop me, coppers. I got a slaughter fest going on in here. Okay, what am I going to do, guys? What am I going to do? How am I going to get out of here and get the points? The only way to do it. Honestly, the only way to do it... I don't know how I'm going to do it. I mean, they're all outside now at this point. They're, what? They broke open the door! Okay, this is a bad look. I got a kid just floating head by his neck. Oh, my God. All right. Burn Trap's pretty good. Not going to lie. Let's try another animatronic, though. All right. The next animatronic that we loaded up is Eleanor, whose special ability is Tinker. Make suits worth more than... Whoa. Make suits worth two times more for 10 seconds. For 10 seconds. Wait, that's a great way of earning points. Don't you trust me? Oh my gosh, this is a new voice actress too, I believe. And she's fast! Whoa! I like the AI on Eleanor. She's pretty fast. Okay, so we got we can activate it now. Oh, and no kids. Every single kid wants to follow her. Look at that. I mean, she is a lot more friendly looking than Burn Trap. I'll give her that. Come on, come on, guys. Come on. Let's try this out. I might actually get a ton of points here. Bro, Eleanor is sick. Come on, guys. Come on in. Come on in. Come on in. Let's close this. All right, let's not open the door this time. I got to be real careful with how, who I'm clicking here. Good, 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 good. There we go. Okay, that's so much better, bro. Okay, now let's go ahead and activate our ability. Which one gives you the most? It's probably Golden Freddy, right? Wait, 20? 20. 24? These stink! Oh my god, bro, the best one is Golden Freddy. That's trash. 78 points. What am I going to do with that? Oh man, we're going to have to go back to the freaking Fred Bears for this. Actually, no, I don't have the suits at Fred Bears. All right, we're going to have to go to at least sister location with these kids, bro. bro that's so bad. That's on double XP as well. Holy, she is an Olympic track star. Look how fast Eleanor is. My god, she's so quick. All right, let's see. Let's go ahead. We'll, we'll get all the kids from FNAF 2. We'll bring them down to sister location and we'll put them in the scooper. I think that will give us the most points, especially doubled up. All right, let's see. Let's collect, collect, collect. Very nice. Very nice. Come on, children or robots, whatever you prefer to be called. We all know what your true secret identity is. There we go. All right. I think that's everybody here. Okay, so, so far, Eleanor has a 100% completion rate when it comes to getting the kids. Like... Bro, she can get every single kid. Easy peasy. There's not, I, there's not one kid that said they don't want to follow. 
Literally none. They're, they are completely, uh, like, tranced by her. All right, let's go down. We're going to get the sister location, ladies. Now, maybe maybe it's a, a boy thing. Maybe the girls don't, don't feel as trustworthy. I am your nope. Friend. She said she's her friend. They all believe it. All right, perfect. That's really good. Oh, my God. Look, guys, literally not a single one has told her no. Her voice does clip, though, I will say. I know where your friends are. Oh, my God, dude. This is so great. Don't you trust me? Nobody doesn't uh, like everybody follows her. She's broken. This is probably the best animatronic in the game. Um, let's go back here. Grab the last remaining ones. And this should be enough to unlock the suit if we get double XP here. Alright, come on in. Yeah, everybody, literally everybody said yes. Everybody in. I would go to Fred Bear's, but the big problem with that is that we don't have a suit over there. So can't really do that. It won't do much good. All right. Now the slaughter begins. The slaughter begins, ladies and gentlemen. Taste my steel knife. All right. Okay. Wait. Hold on. Hold on. Not yet. Hey, okay, we got to be careful here again. Careful again. Careful again. Careful again. Uh oh. I almost clicked it. There. And last one. All right. Good. The door is still closed. All right. So now I'm going to activate our ability. Oh my God. Look how many points. Oh my god! That's insanity! Oh man, it's over. It ends so quickly though. Bro, that's plenty of points. I think we're good. So wait, she gives how many points? Is it? So from 5,000 to 160. Okay, so it's good. It's like 150 points or something like that. And then you give yeah, pff, nowhere near as much, dude. That The scooper and Eleanor combined, that is the place to be. Oh my god, guys, look how many points we've gotten. Five thousand. Okay. Dude, this is amazing. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go ahead and activate our ability for these last couple ones. The only problem is they're too far. I gotta run over here, run back. I don't have enough time. We need the the, the sweeper thing again, the little vacuum. The, which used to be called something that I'm not even gonna say. It, it used to be, have the most inappropriate name. If you know, you know. But if not, let's just say it had a pretty inappropriate name and uh, not something you should probably mix with kids. <laughs> Wait. Oh my god. Oh my god. There was a little boy through the freaking wall. Right. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Nothing to see here. One more for the road, baby. Okay. Put our knife away. And let's go ahead and escape through the secret hatch. I don't even feel like going. I think this is plenty of points to uh, get us out of here. All right, let's go into first person. Bro, this is so cool, man. I love this new animatronic. What a great idea by GFC to put her in the game. Man, this is smooth. Okay, so we could go through the secret hatch, which is probably what I'm going to do. I don't think you get any more points for going through the hatch or taking the car. So we're just going to go through the, the hatch here. This is the closest way to escape. Boom, escape. Uh, you can't escape yet. Police is not look. Oh, I see. You only do it when the police are coming for you. Good idea. That's a good idea. And it actually works because that's how I escaped once when the police were chasing me as uh, Pit Bonnie. But all right, let's take our car, go home, and then guess what, guys? We have two suits that we can still unlock. Yeah, 9,000. Okay, yeah, we definitely have enough. We definitely have enough for these suits now. So we're going to go to the shop, head over to the final level and then look guys upgrades suits 5,000 10,000 that should give us two new suits so let's go ahead and try one more animatronic to see just how good they are we could try the mexis the mxes because we are going to the newest level we'll use the newest animatronic and i've kind of figured out how to use them now so you can see here teleport to level one wait what this is determined on which level is closest to you, and we'll choose the next level. The Crack Firewall. Oh, guys, look! Fredbear and Spring Bonnie. Boom! The new Fredbear animatronics. All right, so to move with MXES, if you go into third person and you just click W. Oh, man. I love the voice acting, too. Wow, he says, blah, 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 blah which actually translates to, what? A kid didn't follow. Interesting. Doesn't this look like a trustworthy guy if he came up to you? Wouldn't you trust him? <laughs> okay, the MXES is actually really bad. He's actually horrible. He's garbage compared to the other animatronics. All right, so we're going to take these kids. Let's try the teleport thing. Will they follow? What? 
All my kids! They left all the kids! Okay, dude, that is garbage. That, okay, so now I can teleport to level two. But the problem here is that there's no way the kids from level, from the Fred Bears, they would have to go through the waterfall, they'd have to go up the escalator. There's no way they followed me. So now you just kind of miss out on all the kids. And they can't, these kids can't follow me either if I, let me see. Yeah, look, watch. He can't follow me over to level two. It's impossible. Okay, yeah, he's kind of bad the more I think about him. Because if you want to just leave levels, it's pretty simple. All you'd actually have to do is just go back to the main menu and leave. It's not like you can get your points from the kids anyways. And nobody wants to follow him. He literally doesn't... He gets no uh, kid riz, which... Okay, wow, that sounds bad. He gets no, like, you know... He doesn't convince any children to follow him. But then again, I guess he's not even saying real words. He's just going and kids can't understand him. All right, let's just go back to, I mean, let's just go back to Fred Bears. Let's get the kids that we, wait, don't tell me I have to do this all over again. Okay, no, we got a couple kids here. I just want to see how many points Fred Bears animatronics will give us. So, all right, we got the children, the chiddos, the children in here, the kiddos is what I was going to say. And now I got to close the door. And, um, all right, let's pull out our knife and see just how hard this is to get the children. Uh-oh, wait, he doesn't, you can't see what you're aiming at. If I could open the door on accident. No, good, we're good. All right, so who gives you more, Fredbear? Whoa, dude, that was 2,000 for Fredbear. Oh, wait, I don't, is it 2,700, 2,750 for Spring Bonnie or? No, 250. Oh, okay, 250 and... 500 for Fred Bear. So $500 a children, a child, if you put them inside a Fred Bear. That is legit money right there, baby. I love that. All right. So 500 right here. And one more. The only good thing I guess you can say about the MXES is that you can teleport to the very first level and then just escape with him. And he teleports through a lot of things. But. Other than that, he's not the best. He's probably my least favorite I'm trying for one. You move really weird with him with that whole teleporting thing. Two, his ability is completely useless. So he just like jumps from place to place when you can literally just do this if you really wanted to. But I guess when it comes to escaping, it's quick because you could just like skip all the way to the first level. But then again, I, I, I don't know. I'm not a huge fan of it. But guys, that completes all of the shop updates for now. Now, if you guys do want to see some more, I have one more video that could do pretty well if you'd like to see it. I'm thinking about doing a complete 10 secrets that you missed in Killer in Purple before the game actually comes out video. And if you do want to see that, do me a big favor. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button if you're new to the channel. And without further ado, I'll see you in the next one. Till then, peace out!